Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 9th of August 2025. I hope you are keeping well. It's really, really hot here in Bangkok again. I know it always is, but you know, it's not always. Occasionally we have a cooler day here and there, but today is not one of those. Uh, it's sweltering. If you hear any strange sounds during this video, it's probably my one of my telephones uh, doing the uh, message uh, feature um, because uh, I need to keep it on because the cat is currently at the hospital and uh, they normally send me a message to say when I can come and pick him up. So I'm listening out for that. Um, it's the 9th of August. It's 2025. That means it's exactly 80 years since the bombing of Nagasaki, a terrible event in history. Um, we should never forget that that was really uh i mean i okay so uh of course uh if you've watched this if you've watched this channel for a while you will probably know or possibly know that i have uh they, i was a former uh um a person involved in cnd the campaign for nuclear disarmament i have always believed in nuclear disarmament i still i will always believe in i will never believe in the use of nuclear weapons never ever and uh of course uh it's 80 years ago since they were used. Um, but the bombing, so, you know, the, some people try to justify these bombs. Uh, if you justified the bombing of Hiroshima, saying that it brought an end to the war, all right, that's your opinion, uh, and you could have that opinion. But what about the bombing of Nagasaki? What was the point of that? Three days after, three days, they said, oh, Japan was taking too long to surrender. No, you have. if you understood Japanese culture, you would understand how they have to try to save face a little bit. Um, but no, they just, they just continued. Three days after Hiroshima, they bombed Nagasaki and killed uh, tens and tens of thousands of people needlessly and, of course, caused the deaths of many more over the decades to come with uh, fallout radiate from radiation etc um it, it really was never justified um and of course not, i don't think that personally i don't think that either of them were justified but you know if you even if you subscribe to that view that hiroshima was justified i don't think you could justify nagasaki uh, but and uh, now so where are we going now that's the problem but you know uh, we saw the rise of fascism in Germany and the, the imperial Japanese taking over. Now it's different countries. Rise of fascism, yes, in one of the world's most powerful countries. Uh, it's not good. And uh, a country that owns huge amounts of weapons, more weapons than anywhere else and more nuclear weapons than anywhere else, more than the rest of the world combined, probably. So... Um, you know, it's a dangerous, dangerous place where we are right now. But never mind, Sudoku is still safe, <laughs> at least for the time being. We're OK for the time being playing Sudoku. Nobody, nobody will attack us for it until um, until maybe, I don't know, one day the anti-Sudoku brigade come out. Uh, yeah, maybe it will happen. You know, I mean, they're against logic. Uh, so many of people are against logic and education. So maybe one day they'll be attacking us for playing Sudoku. But for now, we can get away with it. Let's start with eight. It's the first number in the L.A. Times hard level Sudoku puzzle today. Seven blocking across there and there. Six blocking across the top two rows and one from the bottom. There we go.
well I'm not making much progress yet so let's see uh, if we can spot anything by going slowly uh, in this way I have seen something I've got one and four blocking this particular square here and I've got one and four blocking those squares so what I can say is that those squares must contain one and four uh, and that means that whatever goes in here is not one or four for this column now what is it then it's five six seven so seven or immediately blocks these those two squares so that's the seven and this will be five and six um, so that gives me fives up there six is there oh okay six blocking this square so there's the six there's the five then that was nice little find that uh, missing digits down here are two eight nine I think got an eight and a nine there uh, so two and five then so two and five blocking up there two and five blocking up there that's a pair of two and five in those squares three blocks across there that must be a three that's two and five this is one and four that's one and four we know already Okay, so four is in one of these squares here, blocking across four blocks up there, also downwards. Four has to be in one of these squares, blocking to the bottom, four across there, that will be a four. Four across this way and this way, there's a four. Missing numbers in this row, 2, 3, 5, 3 and 5 attack this square here, so that must be a 2, now 2, oh no, <laughs> we already know 2 and 5 are there, that won't give it to me, that won't give it to me. 3 blocking across there will give me a 3 in that square, and we will have 2 and 5 in these squares. Uh, this is 5 and 3. Three. We've got three blocking down there. There's a three. There's a five. Uh, this is eight, nine. Is that right? we got nine across there. There's the nine. There's the eight. Missing digits down here. Eight, seven, eight, and two, I think. Seven there. Seven, eight, two. So this has to be one, one and six. Six blocking down there, there's the six, there's the one. One blocking to the top. Now, if you remember, we had one and four in these squares, so that can't be one. That has to be a one there. One across here, one is in one of those squares blocking there, or one up there, one up there, there's a one. No completed digits yet, but we seem to be going quite well, I think. Well, it feels like that, don't you think? Feels like it to me. Uh, in fact, let's just look at the digits in order, maybe, as the next thing to do, and then we'll do a bit of something else if we need to.
Seven up there, seven down there, seven across there. There's a seven. Seven this way, down there, across there. There's a seven. Seven down to the bottom. There's a seven. What are we left with? Two, eight. Any joy on two or eight? No, not really. But seven is finished. So that's something. One up, one down, one across there. One across there, one across there, one up there. One to the top. And up there, there's one. Ah, this is four, isn't it? We had two five in those squares, and we have one four in those squares, so that's our four. four blocks this square and four blocks up there that's the four the last number in this column is six six blocks across here across there down there and there's a six Three down here, three up there, there's a three. Three across this way, three up there, there's a three. Three here, blocking here, blocking there, there's a three. Three blocking to the top, and this one finishes digit three. Yes, it does. Okay, we still need twos. Can we get two yet? sure still need four how are we doing on four four across there four across there gives us four in that square Eight, eight blocks across there. There's an eight. We'll finish this block here with a nine. Get the last number there, which is uh, two, I think. Two blocking down. There's a two. This has to be an eight. And there's one number left for this column. I think it's a nine. Nine blocking across here and up there. So there's a nine and two blocking across there there's our two this has to be a five five down here there's a five the missing number there is two two blocking to the top here there there's a two five blocking up there five across there there's a five five back that way there's a five missing number here's a two two across here and across there gives us two there now there's only one square left in this row four will do it and this must be a nine and uh back over here we're looking for four i think it is okay and we've got nine blocking up there so there's a nine this must be an eight eight blocks across there there's an eight 
and to go here a five will finish the game okay so not too tough today's bunch of sudoku puzzles nice to be back playing though thank you again once again for everybody that's playing the old games while i'm busy working thank you bye bye